School Meals and Shokuiku, or Food and Nutrition Education in Japan through the lens of planetary health for the children and a sustainable future. We see that climate change is tied closely to our eating habits and in turn our nutritional status. An important concept for resolving this issue is planetary health. According to Professor Fumiko Kasuga, a health researcher at Nagasaki University, Planetary health is the idea that our social and economic activities should be practiced in a comprehensive manner based on the understanding that the health of the planet and the health of human beings are interrelated. Planetary health therefore envisions people putting their collective wisdom together to solve today's diverse, interconnected, and complex problems and create a new world. Thus, planetary health seeks to solve this problem through practices based on the understanding that the health of the planet and the health of human beings are interrelated. Let us consider school meals and shokuiku in Japan as one concrete practice based on this planetary health concept. This is Asaba Higashi Elementary School. At lunchtime, Children who are on the school meal team put on smocks. Does anyone have a fever, stomach ache, or feel unwell? No. Is everyone wearing their smocks? Yes. You all washed your hands, right? Did you disinfect yes. too? Great. Let's go. For Shokuiku, it is important that students prepare and serve school meals themselves. By forming teams, they have a valuable opportunity to learn the important skills of responsibility and cooperation. Let's put our hands together and say thanks. Thank you for this meal. Today's menu features fried fish and curry udon noodles, plus locally grown flavored bok choy and watermelon. In this way, shokuiku is also sometimes practiced during lunchtime itself. Quizzes are also given based on the day's menu in order to encourage the children's food-related education. It's sweet. Enjoying locally grown bok choy is another example of a planetary health-related action. Fukuroi City School Meals promote the concept of local production for local consumption using vegetables purchased from local farmers. This farm grows the bok choy for use in school meals. Mr. Tokuyuki Makino says that there are numerous merits to participating in the Fukuroi City School Meal Program as a farmer. Mr. Makino normally has to load vegetables into a box along with packing materials when sending them to places like Tokyo or Osaka. But providing them for local school meals requires only minimal packaging. In addition, there are lower delivery fees and less gasoline use, which also helps to lower CO2 levels. The city is also aiming to use more local products, which have increased in number to 46. These appear on the menu each day. This helps children learn about local agriculture, distribution, and food products, and is expected to have positive educational benefits. In addition, Looking at monthly figures revealed that using local products in school meals has had a positive effect on reducing food mileage and the level of CO2 emissions. Using local produce in school lunches reduced CO2 emissions by a total of 15.37 tons. Anyone is able to can improve their own health through eating habits. Children's palates and eating habits are said to develop around age 10. And by introducing vegetables, fish, and other foods that they may not have tried at home,
School meals can enrich their eating habits and build a healthy foundation for eating in adulthood. In Japan, the role of the school meals is therefore quite significant. JICA's cooperation on school meals and shokuiku. Dr. Marika Nomura, a JICA senior advisor, says this about JICA's international efforts. JICA is conducting international cooperation based upon these types of experiences in Japan related to school meals and shokuiku. Our technical cooperation project in Mongolia includes support for creating standards for school meals, building the capacity of people involved in the preparation of school meals, creating a system for food procuration, and strengthening the administrative capacity that is essential for the institutionalization of school meals. Through our country-specific training program for Malaysia, administrators have been invited to Japan to observe community daycare centers, private food companies and so on. In addition, we are supporting the development of a management framework for providing school meals to Malaysian preschoolers. In Indonesia, the National Nutrition Agency was newly established in August 2024. JICA invited members of the relevant ministries to Japan in order to observe school meals and shokuiku in Japan and to discuss Indonesia's new school meal program. All stakeholders on the planet are called upon to respond to climate change. Planetary health is one approach to this issue that protects human health and the health of the planet at the same time. As one concrete practice based on this approach, JICA will continue supporting school meals and shokuiku alongside the rest of the world.